The creation of a new life inspires awe and wonder when we consider how amazing it is that each of us began as two little gametes. We may occasionally forget how difficult it sometimes is to successfully bring these two cells together. And what can be done for a couple who, for whatever reason, are unable to naturally conceive? Is there any hope? Here is a glimpse into the world of fertility treatments and the various options available to you. As you might suspect, sperm and eggs have a natural attraction for one another. But on nature's road to pregnancy, a number of roadblocks can prevent them from meeting. Sperm, with the best of intentions, are often thwarted by the dangers on the very highway system they must use. And so, fertility scientists have built some very effective bypass routes through assisted reproductive technology. Let's take a look at the four most common routes involving donor sperm. Route 1 is known as ICI, intracervical insemination. With Route 1, donor sperm are inserted directly into your cervix, bypassing roadblocks such as the intravaginal defenses and the cervical mucus, where many sperm perish. Once in the cervix, the sperm are able to naturally continue their journey through the uterus to the approaching egg, somewhere in the fallopian tube. Because these sperm are preserved in seminal fluid and freezing protective fluid, their natural motility or spontaneous movement is preserved. This is the longest route to fertilization and requires the most sperm to make the journey. The second route is known as IUI, or intrauterine insemination. The Route 2 bypass goes beyond the cervix, which might interfere with the traveling sperm, by inserting them directly into your uterus. Because the natural seminal fluid in which sperm live is a substance that causes uterine cramping, the sperm must go through a process we call washing to remove the substance. Donor sperm is available in both washed and unwashed vials because some clinics like to do their own washing. Since this route is a little shorter, fewer sperm are needed to make the journey. Route 3 is known as IVF, or in vitro fertilization. For the adventurous sperm, this route takes a different side road, one that passes through a laboratory. In this laboratory, the eggs harvested from your ovaries are placed in a nutrient-rich fluid with donor sperm. Once the sperm fertilizes the eggs, the resulting embryos are carefully monitored and, if all is well, are placed into your uterus or frozen for future use. IVF treatment bypasses the perils of the cervix and uterus and even less sperm are needed to achieve fertilization. Finally, when the road to pregnancy is just too challenging for sperm to navigate, you have the option of Route 4, which is known as ICSI, Intracytoplasmic Sperm Injection. This route involves a process where a healthy donor sperm cell is injected into a healthy egg cell harvested from your ovary. After several days of maturation, this embryo is carefully placed into your uterus, where it can implant and complete its development. Since only one sperm is needed for each egg, this route requires the fewest number of sperm for the journey. While pregnancy itself is wonderful and inspiring, the technologies that modern science provides to all who wish to have children are, in their own way, awesome. Zytex is committed to partnering with you on this journey by providing high-quality donor sperm. It is best to consult with your doctor about the best route for you. 